a great scorer in his own right, the Bulls All-Star Game MVP, Scottie Pippen, is holding court. They were the perfect one-two combination. The king and the pretender to the throne. When the king stepped down, the pretender moved swiftly, assuming leadership of the reigning world champions. I told Scotty, I told BJ, I told John, I told all the guys, you, you still have the faith, you have the ability to achieve what you want to achieve. You just got to believe in it. The day Michael re retired, his locker was cleaned out by the Bulls. I thought it was going to become a memorial, but uh, instead, Scotty moved right in. I think it was a very bold move for Scotty. the same locker? Absolutely. Into the biggest locker in a very small little locker room in, in the stadium. But I think he was saying to everyone, it's now my team. I think for many years, people have said, I'm not all star, I'm just riding Michael's coattail. Well, this was an opportunity when Michael departure for me to really uh, step forward and show some leadership. And maybe somewhere along the line, he realized that he doesn't have to be Michael Jordan. He can be Scottie Pippen. And that's certainly good enough for us. Scottie Pippen is bullish on both ends of the floor. He's the top forward in the league in steals and assists being like Mike in almost every way. He hasn't walked onto the court thinking because Michael left and his 32 points went with him, he had to find a way to get those points. Uh, I would go so far as to say that Scotty in our league is probably the most complete player we have. Scotty could, you know, go out and take the game upon his shoulders and uh, shoot it 30 times a game, but uh, he's not that type of player. And, uh, this year, everyone needs to, you know, touch the ball and be in, in the offense, and uh, that's what we're doing. I'm not going to be the NBA lead scorer, so um, I'm not out there to try to put up big numbers. Uh, I'm, I'm more or less out there to make us look good as a team and make us play well. He is the Chicago Bulls' reassuring voice on the floor. But Pippins had to stand up to those who challenged him in past playoffs. The label of easy to intimidate no longer applies. The mental toughness has probably been added to his game. A lot of times you see him stand up to a lot of the guys now, and uh, opposed to when he was a little bit younger, he kind of overlooked it and just like, well, you know, I'm just going to play my basket, my game, and not worry about it. But I think sometimes you just have to stand there and make a stand just to let him know that you're not going to be intimidated. I think that's what he's doing now. I just kind of play through it. I feel like that if I be quiet and just go out on the court and let my play take over, and they will shut them up. No matter how much I've been criticized, um, I've always got the last laugh, and I got three wings to show.